One of the great sources that I've always used is JLJ Hughes Patentee Officers um, for Ireland, which is produced by the Irish Manuscripts Commission back in the early 1960s. And it's building on the work of previous historians and archivists such as uh, John Lodge in the mid 18th century and Rowley Lascelles in the 19th century. And it's not a typical IMC production in that it features lists of um, individuals who are given employment by the state or held office in the state. And so it's a compendium of information taken from many different manuscripts, but it's an invaluable source for those who study uh, governance and administration and office holding in Ireland. It's a critical source for tracking and tracing those who are appointed to office from the very high office, such as Lord Chancellor, right down to the housekeeper of the House of Parliament. A list like this is critical and the work that the IMC does in publishing material like this is absolutely essential to the work that the historians do because lists like this aren't really published anywhere else. An earlier version of this where much of this material is taken from LaSalle's Libra Munerium Publicorum in Hibernia and it's available in some of the libraries in Dublin but as we've seen for instance over the Covid times these materials aren't always uh, available to us so to have these available for purchase that they can be taken home and kept in in your study makes it all the more essential. <laughs>